I'll leave it on that screen for a minute. I'm getting these last two pill pieces done. But people can see, even, you're like, it's muted. I'm like, you're the only one in the chat. <laughs> I can see it. <laughs> That's okay. All right, I'm gonna have to mute myself because I hate hearing my voice on stream. <laughs> Just turn the stream down. That's what I did. Oh, I was like, the fuck, how are you gonna help me if you keep muting yourself? No, no, I, I muted my, the stream. I can draw you a little avatar for when you're in here if you want. <laughs> <laughs> you sit on the other side with your cards in your hand and mute you or some shit. <coughs> I have been playing Yu Gi Oh! However, it's, it's gone downhill quite a bit. Oh, am I not getting my six subs anymore? I haven't... How much would that be? A lot. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Already over 20. Probably about 30. People do it nope. left and right, though. I don't know how people just casually throw, like, ten subs or something. Money. Yeah, I have lack there of it. Ah, <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> oh, damn it. It's getting out of my system. I'm gonna have to edit it all out. Though. Why is my screen black on Twitch? I don't know, I killed my stream entirely. Right now I see the hand fade. That's black on my screen, I won't load it. Well, I can see it. What? Yeah, like nothing is loading for me. Is my computer shitting itself again? I think it's Twitch. It's constantly crashing the stream. No! Can't even see my panel is below. What the fuck? two days ago. Hmm. Uh, there was... What happened? What? Oh, uh, someone from Steel Series just made a tweet uh -oh. 20 seconds ago saying, Twitch, please don't go down right now. What am I supposed to watch while I'm eating? <laughs> I can't do this. That's funny. Went live for the first time in months on Twitch, and the website went down. Went live again today, and it goes down again. That was 37 seconds. Oh my god. Two days ago, they had a major outage. What is going on? Yeah, now there's like random people on the front page that have gone black screen. <laughs> you would think that Twitch would able to handle this many people if they're already charging more money. I don't know what to do with it. Do, do we just sit here and talk shit for a few minutes and see if it fixes itself? <laughs> yeah, let's just keep on talking about the place that you're using. I'm no! sure that will not end <laughs> badly at all. <laughs> no, we don't have to talk about that. Twitch. We can talk about something else. <coughs> we can talk about how I can't stop coughing. Hold on. Ah, uh, being sick is awful. I've been sick since. Let's see. I've been sick since last Sunday. No, the twenty fifth. So I've been sick for almost two weeks. 
Thank you, baby. Bye -bye. This job. That's all that. Thank you. I don't know what would be causing Twitch to go down. The mass amount of people that decided this year is their year to fucking stream. It's like exact moment in time. <laughs> Riley, if you well, can you? It's our year, baby. Can you see the screen? Like, can you see that it says "Hand of Fate"? Well, I have confirmation. A random one of my friends messaged me saying, "Hey, are you busy?" I said, "Yes and no." <laughs> What's up? Is Twitch acting up for you as well? <laughs> <coughs> okay, Riley says well, you... he can see it too. I'm just the only one who can't see my own fucking stream, apparently. It's blocked down for me. It was closing the stream constantly for me. Because I haven't hit the link. I haven't hit the link. Oh, this is wonderful. This is just wonderful. What? <laughs> I have an ad. Ah, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're getting a weird page too. Refreshing. No, that's the funny thing is that it's magic that oh. the stream can't work. However, oh wait. Riley said maybe, maybe you. To... <laughs> Riley said maybe you should sub. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's give the website that's not. It works now. I see it. I it refreshed. crashed for me again. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> okay, well, I see it. I'm trying to get this last bit of this pill down so we can fucking get started. <laughs> Everyone right, she see? cut up the pill. Shut up! He knows! <laughs> he watched me do it last night. <laughs> Buggy! <laughs> Oh man, I'm about to go spray no spray too in a minute so I can fucking breathe through this. It's basically a horse pill for her. Okay, I'm about to send a picture of this fucking pill so you can see what it looks like. It's huge! I've taken one. I hate it. The only time I've ever managed to get a pill that's like this big down was when I got my wisdom teeth out because I couldn't feel it when it went down. I don't know if that would be dangerous or not. My mouth was full of gauze. <laughs> it had a straight shot straight to my throat. <coughs> well, give me a second. Now that that's, well, I was gonna say it was working, now it's refreshing again. It seems to be stable right now. Yeah, it's stable. For how long, I don't know. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna have to record this one as well. I don't know what the fuck's going on. My lips are so chapped! Hey, June! I'm just trying to get a pill down. <laughs> and clear my nose out so I can stream. This is going on, uh, this stream's gonna be a little different. This one's going up on the YouTubes. Oh, that was not the best thing I just did. Hmm. <laughs> I thought you were talking about me. I was like, you can leave. I have to call a company to ask how to best learn their product and then report back to Mike. I think Mike, I think Mike has the same social anxiety as I do about calling. What the fuck? Yeah, you're supposed, you're supposed to do that on your own, dude. <sighs> Let me go blow my nose. I'll be right back. Jesus Christ. We're gonna get started, I swear to God. Murder. <laughs> 
one way or a fucking another, we're gonna get started. I mean, the only thing has changed, Riley, is that you're in the chat now and not the VC. No, I just really like this game, and the last time that Daya has played this game, she rage quit. So is this a two-player game, or you just wanted to be in a call? My voice needs to be heard! <laughs> it is a one-player game. Kyle just knows the game better, and he was the person to suggest it, what, four years ago? And I haven't finished it, so I figured if he's here to help, I can get through it. This feels like I'm the middleman. <laughs> he's over there playing another game right now. Some robot card game. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. <laughs> robot card game. Is that what it's called? No. It's oh. Called <laughs> What's so hard? Just play the the game. Baba is you. How do I? Uh, I have been wanting to get that game for a while. We've been watching uh, two people. Well, we, we've been falling asleep to their stream of it because they streamed it for like six hours. So he's here to prevent you from rage quitting. Baba is You is so good. Why does everyone know this game? I just recently learned about it. Wait, you just learned about Baba is You? Yeah, we've been watching it like the last two days because I'd never seen it before. It has been out for a time. <laughs> Look, bitch. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. You know my life is Elder Scrolls, literally. Like, that's it. And Valheim recently. Baba is you. Baba is rock. Baba is float. Baba don't like that. <laughs> is Baba is you something I should be playing? I don't remember how to solve any of the puzzles. I... I learned about all the hidden puzzles in Baba is you, and... I still would not know how to solve any of them. <laughs> Great. Love that let me get this last now that I can breathe I swear you have taken so much drugs in the span of mm -hmm. a half an hour Guess what? I bit that one in half too. <laughs> How many pills have you had? That one big one cut into four pieces. <laughs> I bit the middle in half. Ugh. It scraped the back of my throat. <laughs> oh, I'll never be able to make that noise again. <laughs> <coughs> You had to do four? I had to cut it up into four, yeah. Look, but at least I'm covered till 2 a.m. So, I mean, I'm not upset. I can definitely tell it's making a difference. If I cough in anyone's ear during this, I am so sorry. Um... 
Let's see, I've been sitting here. Riley, if we sit here for 20 more minutes and talk about bullshit, I'll be like Pat. I'll be able to talk for 40 minutes without playing a game. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's a streamer he watches that I fucking shit on. I love him to death, but I shit on his streams because for about an hour, he'll just talk. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it's helping. Good. <laughs> That's my favorite part of his stream. <laughs> we skip it every time. If we can. Or if it's like, it's like, oh, Pat's streaming, we'll go check it out in like an hour when he actually starts playing. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess I can get started. Do you have anything else you need to do today? Am I keeping you from something? In no. this case, okay. I don't want to keep you here, and then you'd be like, yeah, I have to go get groceries, there's a blizzard. <laughs> like, <laughs> Okay, the Midwest is out of the blizzard. We did have snow yesterday, though, and it's annoying. I would love snow. What is it here right now? It's so hot. It's already hot again. It's 62 out there right now. You're welcome to take all the ice that is here. I hate it. Yeah, I was real tempted. <laughs> I was going to ask Riley, Riley, can we take a trip to Iowa just, <laughs> just to see the snow? <laughs> <laughs> You're keep, keeping That would be him. a very boring trip. <laughs> you know, I wasn't gonna shit on it, but the fact that I saw nothing from the airport ride to the apartment ride, it says a lot. <laughs> there is nothing but flat land in Iowa. I remember that time, what was it? Uh, we were about to pull a subway and there was that random sign on the side of the road and there was a vulture sitting on it. And I was like, <laughs> holy shit! <laughs> and that was in winter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I immediately regretted that subway too. Oh god. That was, yeah, it's just, <laughs> there was nothing, and then I saw a vulture, and I was like, oh, that's a sign. <laughs> I love that it was also during wintertime that you would see that. It didn't look like wintertime, because there was, like, nothing, like, well, it was cold. Yeah, there was no snow, and then it was, then it was magic all snow into Christmas, because that's just what Iowa does. I It was... It was so weird. Like, I would wake up, and there was, like, nothing. And then the next day, he's like, oh, by the way, <laughs> about to get, like, ten inches of snow. And I'm like, what the fuck? Okay, what do we need to do? It sounds like heaven. It was hell. <laughs> we didn't know what to do. <laughs> he didn't know what to do. He had someone there who didn't know what the fuck to do in that situation. <laughs> yeah, we went to the beehive. The beehive! What's it called? Hi V. Hi V. Yeah, okay. See, I know the name. I just say it to be a dick. The high V was kind of cool though. It was interesting to see. There, well, there, y'all's high V. If we can ever take you, it reminds me a lot of a uh, Kroger's here. Unless y'all have a Kroger's, you might. I don't think we do. So how's Canes? Have you gone to Canes at all? No, I have not. What the fuck? How have you not? Because it's such a long drive. Yeah, and you don't like the sauce, so it's fucking pointless for you. <coughs> I mean... <coughs> Spicy ketchup. No, that's Whataburger! <laughs> oh, that's <great>. <laughs> <laughs> No, the Canes was just the, it was the cane sauce, but it was like the pink Thousand Island type of sauce. Did I just call it Thousand Island? Yeah, you tried it and you were like, isn't that all it is? And I'm like, shut your mouth. <laughs> it is not just that. Let me close some of these ads. Oh, that's right. I was going to play Sims earlier and then I was like, never mind, I'll stream. This is 
been a very productive stream. <laughs> I mean, hydrate. I have water and coffee. Thanks, Oni. I need to warm up with coffee. We'll do that later, though. I'm shutting down some of these apps that don't need to be going. Oh, I almost shut down Steam. <laughs> well, uh. I'm trying to think what the uh, actually kill the game. Yeah, it would shut the game off. <coughs> 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 I'm also trying to get any last huge coughs out of the way before, you know, I lose. Before you are yelling. Yeah. Oh my god. All right, for anyone here, this one's this <laughs> this stream's a little different. So this one's going on the YouTube's. I'll probably hold off on doing my intro and outro until I am off stream, just cause it saves time for me. Um, this is something I have been playing for, it says about three to four years, <laughs> but, uh, I've played it probably mostly for a couple hours. Does it tell me my hours while I'm playing? Yeah, I've played for like a total of four hours. So, <laughs> I'm not very far. <laughs> but, the person who suggested it all those years ago is here. Hello in the chat that I've been talking to. What does the throw shade redeem thing do? Well, if you click on it, it tells you. Uh, I grab the nearest pair of sunglasses and I put them on and play for like 10 minutes. But I usually have my camera on when I do that. Oh, that's what it does. Yeah. I didn't know this. You will like not click on them. They tell you what they do. Where's throw shade at? Yeah. No, not what you think. I have to go grab a pair of sunglasses and wear them for five minutes. Oh, I see it. Yeah, is that why nobody clicks on Smash or Pass? It's <laughs> that one I've had there for so long and nobody uses it. That was a, that was a reward created by a, another mod. Well, now she's the artist of the stream, but... She's a, she was a mod before. I can't read and make sense without hearing that country bro on TikTok. Make sense. Are you gonna redeem it? Oops. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> what? You know what? What? <coughs> <coughs> Leonardo DiCaprio. Smash or pass. Uh. Pass. Only cause now he's such a creep. <laughs> what is his role? He doesn't kiss women older than 25. This is the first I've actually heard of this. But I don't keep track of anything like that. Well, I only heard about it because he... He broke up with someone. Oh, yeah. Leo's Law, first popularized by a Reddit user. Leonardo DiCaprio refuses to date a woman over 25. Yeah, so he won't kiss or date or like have relations with anyone over 25 because he broke up with his girlfriend I think after she turned like 26 <laughs> so I probably uh, funny enough I will be right on the edge of, <laughs> of his uh, his law of dating this year I, I would say pass but I probably would have said smash before Leo about to kick you out. He can kick me out. Guess what? <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <coughs> okay. 
to pass Leonardo DiCaprio like that, the bar is set too high. Riley knows one of the ones that I would say Smash too. I'm pretty sure Kyle probably knows it too. Was that the one that you used as a gif in the server? Yeah! In the most respectful way, I'd smash that ass. <laughs> no, not Mike's. <laughs> Who the fuck is that? <laughs> <gasps> oh, Mike! Uh, you know what? I don't know. Young Mike's kind of cute. Punk Mike? Yeah, Punk Mike kind of cute, though. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about Mike. He's cute. I don't know if I'd smash them. <laughs> the what? The way I was about to word it, <laughs> I was probably gonna get my ass in trouble. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what I was gonna say. Yeah, if anybody watches Red Letter Media, that's who he's talking about. He's one of the guys on there. Not rich. I would never. I would never for rich and Jay aggravates me too much but i love mike <laughs> jay with amish beard oh 100 percent. put aside everything i hate about jay amish beard fuck yes <laughs> all right i've been going for like 35 minutes i should probably play <laughs> there's someone i'm quite interested in you are welcome to keep asking <laughs> I'm just happy y'all are actually using the points because I'm sure y'all have racked up a few and you just don't know what to use them on. <coughs> <coughs> Who are you? Who are you curious? Cool down, but Henry Cavill? Oh. <laughs> that is the only Superman I like, is Henry Cavill. Back so soon. Did you hear about the I Superman on full time the rock? You display yeah. your marvelous dexterity for one who seems such an oaf. I don't know how DC is gonna survive later on. Let me turn the game down a little bit. Discovery is gonna sell them all to Disney and then Disney will own every superhero. Oh. Which will be terrifying. Alright, somebody tell me if y'all can still hear him, <laughs> for one, because that game was loud in my headphones. He made Suicide Squad. I don't know how to feel about THE Suicide Squad, yeah, that, a little bit different. Henry Cavill is a god amongst men. No man or woman can simply pass him. No, I I couldn't. I loved him as Witcher. Um, I'm excited to see what he does with the... Uh, was it Warhammer? Now we play. Right, let's see what I was even at last time. You can time. now access endless mode if you wish to test your skills against chance. Oh, there's barely any delay. Oh, you can endless. You can access endless mode now. Yeah, no thank you. Alright, so... My next opponent is King of Dust? Okay, I was about right. You were about halfway. Well, that's the only one that you can do right now. Challenges. Five, six of dust, four ambush. It was one gold per health loss. 15, 15 health. Fuck me, and Some I don't men have thrive to go in with. anarchy and So chaos. you don't want to fight. The king that's of the dust is thing. one such. His tools are cruelty and terror. And I suspect he will harbor a great hatred for you, my friend. 
Y'all can still hear it. Everything's fine. Just making sure before I keep going. <laughs> I forgot to hit record. I'll just download the stream. Fuck it. <laughs> Upload the whole stream. No, <laughs> I'll edit it down. <laughs> I snotted. <laughs> Sorry. I am so sorry. I don't want to be sick. You know the interesting thing about Suicide Squad is that when I watched a video about Polka Dot Man. Polka Dot Man? <laughs> yes, it, he was a major villain to Batman. Love it. He had magic, not magical, but science. No Take your time if you Polka like. Polka dots. I've waited long enough. Diana has not watched. No spoilers. No, this is about the actual, like, character. <coughs> Polka dots. Almost not my water. Am I building a deck or am I just starting? Uh, you have to build a deck. Oh, son of a bitch. Would you like to use a recommended equipment and encounter deck? Yes. But your it's a good idea to look at it. Your deck has been updated. Yeah, can I still look at them? Okay. Equipment. So... Are these at the bottom? Are these the ones I can add? Yeah, those are what you can add. Why did they just give me a fuck ton of... my regular stuff? I have no idea. I would just take out all the basic weapons and add in all the cool ones. Add in all the cool ones? <laughs> Alright, well I only have those shields, so. Science is fucking rad. Scientists, a little less rad. The frost would be <laughs> nice. Frosting. Mm-hmm. Hammer. The fire will do really well against Tim if you can get it. I guess I'm gonna have to add regular stuff anyway. Or is it this? Uh, you still need to add, you can add the armor. They didn't actually give you any armor. I know, I didn't fucking have any in there when I did it. Um... <coughs> Excuse me, I guess armor of cold? Or does it matter which one? Um, Berserker will be useful. You can click them to see what they do. This card is new, and thus its contents are unknown. So I need to put them in and get them. Mm -hmm. Well, this is what you can find in the game. Like, this is your way of editing this to make it your better chances of succeeding. Having the um, new things will allow you to unlock better things, but it's it's it can be weird sometimes. No, that's yeah. Okay, stairs encounter. Ooh.
What's the merchant's contract? Mercenary contract. Yeah. Well, that's per combat. Press right bumper to activate an aura that makes every successful strike drop gold. That could be interesting since you're fighting gold loss. Oh, yeah. And then I like having these usually if I can get a hold of them. During combat, press right bumper and does eight nines. That's if you're surrounded, it could be very useful. Oh, my nose! Consuming shame? I don't know what that one does yet. I. I don't look. Have to try it. I was like, it doesn't look good, but. Okay. You need 22. Going with the ch chat right now. Science is is subjective. Like science can be really fun to one person, but science also could be extremely difficult and annoying to someone else. I hate science. <coughs> it all depends on the person teaching me if I like it. I would say that would be the software engineer. <laughs> software engineer. Well, I mean, they have to make the website. Learning a lot today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're learning something over there. one science teacher who well I guess it would be chemistry so chemistry is a lot of fun compared to a lot of other science like physics but if you do like demonstrations of physics then it can be really fun the number's not going up anymore it's at 22 well no it's past 22 oh oh Oh, I just noticed. They did make our deck. Ah! <laughs> We're taking things out of the deck. <laughs> yeah, it depends, depends a lot on the person. We're talking like buying them. I hate English, but that could change. That could be because of the teachers or I'm bad at the language. You know, I had an interesting conversation with a couple of people in my philosophy class. They were majoring in... No, they were mastering a degree in math. And I thought, why would some... Why is it that these two people <coughs> would be doing a master's degree in something that is mostly universally hated by many people. Oh, I despise math. 100%. But why is that? Like, what is it that makes it okay for us to just say that we hate math? Well, I hate it because I've never really had a good teacher for it. I'm... Exactly! But I'm like, for college level, I'm like... I'm just now grasping high school math. Like, I'm supposed to be far beyond it, and I am not. But that's the, that's the key thing, is that... Yeah, Riley loves I'm noticing math. that we are really bad at teaching math to people. Because... Just, be, just because sometimes... Oops. Thank you for the follow. My thing is, is, um... 
like I so this last teacher I had I will not mention her name nobody's hunting her down I gave her a stern review at the end of the semester um we did a thing called lattice multiplication I don't know if y'all have ever done that but it's it's really easy to do and it's it's like a it's it's a really weird way to just do long multiplication well I'm left handed so everything I do is backwards like it just happens it's naturally gonna happen backwards like if you write everything left to right on the lattice I'm gonna write right to left it's just how I work she marked me entirely wrong on it because I didn't do it her way see so you this, you now have m- this is a prime example is that we have teachers in, in math that will tell you how to do math but won't explain what is going on in the problem solving aspect of solving the problem Riley <coughs> Riley completely shouted at my homework one time because she was making us do a thing called tower division never I can't even find it if I try to google it like it's not a thing that sounds like just being an asshole she is <laughs> but um Riley like at one point was looking at my paper and he goes what the fuck are you supposed to do <laughs> like he just shouts because he looks at her example and then looks at mine and he's like I don't even know what's going on and I'm like same and she won't explain it <laughs> like <laughs> I had a tutor when I did tricks and the king I showed the homework takes to the time. my uh, tutor and he was like I know I'm not supposed to help you guys with your homework but <laughs> this teacher is not teaching you guys the correct way to <laughs> no everyone learns shit differently and even math even though it is a specific point blank like question and answer there's still you other ways to get the kings. answer oh. each has shaped the nature of their forces with the strength of their will. They will the turn that fast. power to your destruction. They will then turn you that power ask. to destruction. Oh. I gotta choose which way to go? Yeah, you do. Ah! One of these will be the card to go up to the next level, and the other is going to be something. Oh no. Okay. Chat, which one do you want? <laughs> yeah, usually I'm on my own. Do y'all like do y'all have a good feeling about any of these? I can go any direction. Left. Left. Mm. So what will it be? The root of all troubles. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so loan, if you give them enough money, they will give you something for it. I don't you have a lot of for gold. A token now. I'm out I know. my last my last match took a lot out of me. Damn, should have went right. In a busy market town, you are approached by a shopkeeper on the verge of losing his store. I think it's fifty gold. If you lend me the gold I need to save my store, I will repay one day with interest. All I have is ten gold. I I think you're okay for giving him the ten gold. You think Why are y'all shouting directions? <laughs> <laughs> Riley, I can't go off the path. <laughs> Alright. I think give him the gold because you get interest. So the shopkeeper gratefully accepts your gold, saying you won't regret this. The card's token is now yours. There we go. You want the tokens? The tokens unlock so many it good things. to E twelve. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I made that a little too powerful. I will have to rebalance that oh. next time. Wow. After ten steps, gain three, three gold, gold cards. cards. I love how the guy's like, I made that too powerful. <laughs> well, I mean, you Another could get like 30 gold for each card. Alright. And now you have to go back. But you only waste... Okay, so you have gold, health, and food. Yeah. Every time you move, you use your food. 
If you run out of food, you'll start taking damage. Okay, yeah, I always tried to stock up on my food a little bit if possible. All right, which way now? Y'all, a lot of y'all said up. One said up, one said right. Do you mean stage up, which would be right here? Or do you mean up up, which is back there? <laughs> Good just to eeny me my new mo. Riley hears me do that when I'm trying to pick what I want to eat. <laughs> eeny meeny my new mo. Catch a tiger by by the tail. If it hops, what is it gonna do? Eeny meeny my new mo. It amuses me to watch them theorize. To attempt to discern okay, the giving very him food the gives you a blessing. Uh oh. You meet a wandering priest who greets you in a friendly manner. For a small share of your provisions, half my food! <laughs> he doesn't give you a token, so he's not really worth it. No! Well, I'm sure you won't need the help of the gods where you're going. Farewell. Did he just tell me I'm going to hell? <laughs> <coughs> Fuck, man. I'm gonna lose so much food getting out of here. S fucking half of it? Fuck off. You would starve in the first area. For real? What the fuck kind of power were you gonna give me? Should've went right. Head downwards, if you dare. Oh. We got the way out. Yeah, let's go. Fuck it. I can't afford to keep losing food up here. Do you understand how this game works now? Do you Bigger comprehend map. the oh. stakes? What do you Their choices now? What do you mean, do I comprehend it, motherfucker? We're on the fifth boss. <laughs> <coughs> how the game works, imagine oh, your fuck, entire fuck, the bandit is solely loyal bitch. to their king. <laughs> well, time to they fight. Will not let you reach him easily. So, you have the card game where you move and do special things. Yeah. And then you go inside the cards to actual fight. Is this like a roguelike? It's a... It's more of a deck builder than a oh. roguelike. Okay, we're good. We're fine. I just have to remember how to fight. Uh... Oh, there we go. Thank you. Attack, counter, stun, dodge. Counter is whenever you, oh, you shit. see a little green arrow. Fuck! I used to be good at this. Anytime there's green, just hit Y. Kick his ass, it's Batman. <laughs> Fuck, I lost some health doing that. Learning it. Well, well it's a good thing we gave our gold away because we lost it. While searching the area for anything worth salvaging, you realize one of your opponents is pretending to be dead. Rule four takes precedence over rule five. What are the rules? I'm sorry. I have the rule is every time you fight, you lose goal one gold oh, per respect. percentage of your life. <laughs> respect the mods, no pet names. Oh well, <laughs> laughing naked is my boyfriend, <laughs> so he gets he gets the the pass in that. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> He's the only one who gets the pass in that. I'm sorry. I should probably put that somewhere. Come now, hurry up. Oh, don't have forever. Are we killing this guy? Or are we fleeing? <laughs> I don't know what happens if you flee. 
You may ha oh, you may have to go back in and fight them. But it would be only one skeleton. Oh. Choose from these options. <laughs> Sorry, I I don't think about people. <laughs> so many people have not read that rule, and then I have to tell them to not that I don't think about it when he says it. All right, this is I forgot. This is how the chance system works. Yeah, I I remember this greatly in my That's... first episode. The second to last one is what I would have picked. Right here? Second to last. Yeah. Ah! Good. <laughs> no, no, no. They actually make it so you can watch the cards. The game actually does not trick you. You can actually watch the all the cards move and you can find it. I want y'all to know... You don't have to go back and watch, but when I first started playing this, the very first episode I uploaded to YouTube, um, I didn't know that, and I picked, like, a card that immediately sent me falling, tumbling down into, like, a pit, and you just hear, son of a bitch! <laughs> uh, quick weapon blow to the head fixes that. Dealer draws three game cards. I'm sure you're grateful for that. Armory. Draw two, keep so you one. Get... Ooh. I want this, right? <coughs> uh, so that will do more damage to uh, living things. I don't know what this does, though. Fool's gold, I don't know what does. It, uh... And I don't think you have used it yet, so you don't know what it does. But I think it gives you more gold for something. Well, I'm at zero. But then I think you, you're you better off getting the weapon. It'll save you more time in fights. Okay. Fire, in its multitudinous forms, we still hold... Yeah, 32 damage, wonder. comparing using a axe that maybe does 15 equipment with this trait burns with the flame of the ancients doing extra fire damage however lava golems will shrug off fire attacks with ease well you don't have any lava golems right now yeah what's interesting is this is fire and holy so it does damage to skeletons also oh, i was doing 25 damage no, 30. really is that what you're going to do yeah i'm gonna hold on to it. the fuck's wrong with you Three food! Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God, more food. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna take a guess, another fight. <laughs> Winding trail. Uh, this is going to be uh, another challenge of success. Suddenly a tree falls across your path, blocking the way ahead. The dealer draws you one monster card. Four... What the fuck? <laughs> oh. I don't... Uh, can you give half your gold? No, it's not even an option. <laughs> oh. Ah! <laughs> well. Okay. Um, <laughs> fuck. Learn how to roll. And uh, every time you hit C green, press Y. Give them all your zero gold. I can't. I wish we had, like, <coughs> one gold, because I bet you could have actually used that option. Uh. Well. Fuck. They're fine separate. I've never played against them all together. Okay. Do you have your fire weapon equipped? Yeah. Okay, at least the skeletons will do, will take more damage. Weapon ability, left bumper. Okay. It'll do something. <laughs> It'll do something. If you have gold, you can do the option. But if it's less than around five, they attack anyway, because they think you're holding back. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Bet they feel like an idiot <laughs> when they see I've got nothing. 
Ender, have you played the second one yet? I still think the this first one is better than the second, but I do like the more skillful uh, skill checks. Get him! I lost so much health from that. <coughs> You have played both I know, games. it's a shame that the company went under. Oh. Why does our man here look so distraught that I won? Because <laughs> he's not wanting you to win. <laughs> he's like, some bitch. Ah, we got... Buster is always better. Fleet cuts. Oh, you saint. More health to work with. Much good meat, do you? Is this the... I think I said it, but this guy really reminds me of Jack of Blades from Fable, but I can't place it. Oh, I have no money. <coughs> <coughs> oh, shit. In a shady grove off the beaten trail, you find a traveling merchant looking to trade with wandering adventurers. May just sell only specific items that they've discovered in faraway lands. Their prices can be high, but they also pay well for anything that catches their interest. Fuck it. I guess we can go look. Three things to brag about regarding this game. Go for it, brag away. Should I sell my regular axe since I'm not using it? Probably not because sometimes you lose a weapon. Oh shit. I can't buy anything. Oh well. Also, that's pretty impressive, Ember. beat the super boss, true final boss on Warlord. I beat the super mini boss on Adventurer. I'm waiting for that third one. What is the third one? Ender, how long did it take you to beat the golem storyline? Oh my god. I beat the encounter Moonlit Horror with one of the random cards being a boss. Ugh. Cave mouth. The next step of your journey takes you from a cave out to the feet of an imposing forest. Okay. Ooh! Fifteen gold. <coughs> Fifteen gold. 25 gold. <laughs> what brings you to play the game? <coughs> I know you will not tell me. Like all the rest, you are silent. Yeah. I'm it's like... when you have to keep on fighting them over and over and you get a token to unlock the next phase of it. <coughs> Sorry, I'm gonna have to cut that cough out when I edit. Yeah. Call for the priest. Also, you need to. It's a good thing you took that loan because that's how you got all that couple. Mm -hmm. In a shady grove off the beaten trail, you find a traveling merchant looking to trade with wandering adventurers. 
Priests have some skill in tending wounds, but they excel in removing curses for a price, of course. I don't have any curses on me right now, do I? I think you have one, but I don't know if you can get rid of it. Well, I mean, there's only one way to see. I have much to offer you. God. It's the curse that the king has on me. Oh man. I wish I had the money for this. Should I buy more food? <laughs> you only lose gold after you fight something, so you could keep the gold for a, an encounter. That's true. And the one curse we have I can't remove anyway, so... Let's see. Next. Asleep in the forest. Spirits roaming the darkness. With the struggles, the boundaries are weaker than they've ever been. Again, a token is at stake. Oh, we got a token. While sleeping in the forest, you are jolted awake by a voice calling your name. You see a vaguely human-shaped ghost rushing towards you. You are quick to your feet, weapon ready in hand. The ghost stops abruptly, hand signaling that it means no harm. Its voice is weak and distant. You forget me already. Has this place already corrupted you so? Lower your weapon. I should not be here. I fear his servants already know where I am. Ah, my nose! For a brief moment, the ghost's pale eyes feel achingly familiar. Please come home soon. You blink and the ghost is gone. At your feet is a bag of food. The dealer draws you one food gain card. This card's token is now yours. Free food. <sighs> Devil's Carnival. At its heart. These traveling shows are but mockeries of the true mysteries. <coughs> oh, sorry. Hold on. Yeah, can y'all still see? Well, I've lost uh, my visibility, but th that's fine. <sighs> no, I did too. I have it up so I could make sure I could use it as recording! <sighs> I guess I'll hit the record button as well. See what happens for the rest of it. Okay. Switch experiences outage 25 minutes ago. As you plunder the secrets of your memories, you'll gain new cards. 
Some you wish you'd left untied. <coughs> Excuse me. Fuck. One day, just as dust gathers, dusk gathers. Sorry, you reach a large country town hosting a traveling circus. Strange sights and stranger smells confront you as you begin to wander between tents and stalls that were once brightly colored. They are now faded and stained with dust. Peasants and nobles alike wander the streets and alleys, past wonders and amazements, seemed on, seeming almost dazed. There is something about the place that dulls your senses, and for a while you forget your quest, forget even the path that brought you to this place. Fuck! I missed the card, so it's on your end. Oh, no. Well, it's visible now for me. There's a failure, a huge failure, success, and great success. Well, Fuck. did you watch the cards? I think so, but... Oh, thank God. Hey! The cheers and gasps draw you to a large tent. Inside, you discover a number of spectacles being performed by costumed artists. Ah! Uh, it's second to last one. Again? This one? Yeah. Damn. Uh, unseen hands relieve you of some of your gold as you watch a fine white horse being commanded to perform a variety of tricks for the gaping crowd. Dealer draws one gold pain card. Let's just How take unpleasant. five gold and we'll be fine. Hmm. Ow. So, some time later, you find yourself standing at the edge of a forest. The sounds of the crowds behind you. Day is just dawning, but which day? Looking back, you see the ruined buildings of Welcome a back, Jin. Town. Ah, it's all good. Welcome back. Long ago abandoned. Yeah, Twitch is Open having the chat. some issues. See what it contains. Today. I'm curious. While exploring a dungeon, you see a treasure chest at the end of a hall. Chest. There's gonna be a trap that you have to do, but yeah. it will give you an item and gold. Aren't we trying to dodge fighting as much as possible for this one? The trap will just be a pain card. Uh, do I want to do Oh, it? did you see that Nicolas Cage is going to play Dracula? Yes, I did. <laughs> it looks exactly what... It feels like a Nick Cage film. I did not see that card. I think it's the second one. This one? Yeah. Thank God. In the hall is silent as you move forward, you approach the treasure chest. The treasure chest looks battered, but still intact. What treasure might it hold? Gold? Oh, we gotta do another one if we try to open it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! I looked at the chat. I don't know. Um, problem is I was watching the corruption one, and I think it's the second one. But I, well, uh, one is probably safe. The farthest one in the back is actually. Oh, yeah, go one. 
Oh my god. <laughs> <coughs> After a mighty heave, the lock gives way, and the spoils are yours. Four gain cards. Three gold. See, we have four people to watch this, so we could we could work together, everyone, to try to make sure that we never fail. I'm sure you're grateful for that. Ugh. God fucking damn it. It seems you have made an enemy of the rat men. They do not normally attack unless provoked. You stumble upon a rat men hunting party. Prepare to defend yourself. One monster card. You're expecting too much from us. <laughs> <laughs> you just gotta watch the cards very carefully. size you search the bodies finding nothing if there were only another way to stop this plague of ratmen pay someone to take care of it perhaps that would remove all the ratmen in the deeper board, towards our foe do a, a different card oh, okay. we're headed up the stairs i think this is the boss did you expect me to tell your fortune? No. I'm gonna be honest with you. A fortune teller I thought is at the same most base <laughs> and despicable when they begin to believe their own lies. Of course, I am different. My powers are genuine. <clears throat> oh shit. Which way are we going? Chat. Zigzag north. <laughs> He's just gonna take over all the cards. Son of a bitch, you, you are now banned! <laughs> every bandit in the kingdom before you reach the king. I'm kidding. I think this is the boss, so you should be fine, <coughs> actually. <coughs> Fuck. We didn't get much armor, but I don't I think you can take on the boss. Only two. Well, they're <coughs> once faking to be dead. Do they risk it or just leave? What did we get when we killed them? Uh, I think we got some cards, but like I don't remember. I don't know if that's how we got my weapon or not. I mean, whatever. Got the shot. Oh, they didn't even change. <laughs> they were all the same as they were. All 
Alright, Chains of Rage or Ring of Survival? Well, you've not seen the Ring of Survival. I think that's for food, though. Oh. Rage would do more damage to the boss when you're damaged, I believe. That might help. Can you... Chains for armor. Click the armor, since that seems to be the choice. I just want to see if you can look at it. During combat, strikes sustained from bows and wands have a chance to restore your cooldown. Uh, hit back. I just want to see what the ring of survival does. After every third combat, the player receives plus 20 health. That seems pretty good, since you have to fight a lot. I haven't fought anything with wands yet. So that's solid. I'd go with the ring. Yeah, yeah we got some food. Maybe we could have given the priest food. Shut up! <laughs> Nobly mind, or simply noble by birth. Noble traitor. Let us stake a token on their foolishness. A nobleman approaches on a chariot as you walk the streets of Stagall. He notices you and comes to a stop. Greetings, mercenary. I am a collector of rare weapons, and yours intrigues me. Would you part with it for gold? Hell no. Uh, no. <laughs> Disappointing, but my own fault, I suppose, for expecting to find a business savvy peasant who rides away. So I don't get a token because I didn't give him my one weapon. <laughs> yep. But <coughs> you get a lot of gold. Like four or five game cards. So. I mean. If I if had we another, redo this, we could do the re we could redo this floor and <coughs> unlock it that way. <coughs> if I had another weapon on me, I might have, but my I, it would be a downfall on my end to give up this weapon. Down or right? No, it's not. I'm sure we'll come across them again at some point. You can always add it in the deck. Every time there's something that has a token, it will be added to your deck. Oh, okay. Are we clearing this whole board, or are we just going straight across? I mean, you have the food to do it, but I don't know if this is the boss floor or not. I know. Well, that's one fight. You can lose a total of 20 health in between two other fights. Damn it. Choice. Select your desire. We keep going with the third. <laughs> I keep wondering if it's going to catch on to that. <coughs> <coughs> Not sure. I didn't watch it. <laughs> Oh, 
fucking of course, suckers, killing so their leader bitch. is a fine way to provoke them. What? Hey, Ratman. Oh, and the Jack of Plague. Oh. Well. Oh, get my ass beat. What is happening? This, you have to roll. You have to roll when he's in red. Ugh. He's always in red. And so the game takes another life. Do not All right. worry, though. That was the first time. Let me try again. Coming back to this. Truly, game. our game has begun. And you had basically a boss. Stakes are raised. The challenges You're not begin. Right. Hell no, that was the first time. Fuck. That was that happened the last time I fought him too. He got me down to like no fucking health. Yeah, but <coughs> that was only because you forgot about the King of control. Dust is the perfect implement to ensure your destruction. Double check if oh, you bitch. have the loan as an option. At their heart, all games are about power, are they not? Have to the acquiring again. of power, the retaining of power, oh, a new board, and the most loan. importantly, Up front and center. The use of power. So that's that's programmed to be that way. And we know that's the best way of handling it. Very nice indeed. Oh fuck, I fell in this the last time I got it. Oh, this is where you can get a weapon. There you go. Last time I just fell and lost health though. I think you can handle it. Second. This makes it inflicts more damage the lower the health of the wielder. Oh wow, could he use that about five seconds ago? <laughs> <laughs> Whimsy and Caprice, the domains of the old gods. Were they always thus, or has age corrupted their nature? Oh boy, I'm now blind because I ads happily are wait playing on the outcome. I'm sorry. Fuck. I, I tried to control the ads. No, 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 it's all right. 
I just can't help you if it's a success or not. Oh, did you see stuff about the Studio Ghibli um, park? Yes, I did. <coughs> I saw the little bit of it. They redid also the entrance to the museum. It's now the cat bus. Aww. Okay, on a deserted hilltop in a faraway land, you discover an old altar. The gods of the old religion are powerful yet unpredictable in their favors. Do you wish to pray at the altar? Do I pray to the old gods? Basically. Oh shit. the last one. Well, we're gonna be, uh, meeting a... Ha. Let us see how you progress with that millstone around your neck. Of course, you can remove your curses at shops if well, you can find them. Well, at least... Still, it's not the I'm worst curse of the, in the world. No disadvantages. I mean, essentially, you you won't have any gold, but the gang cards are what give you weapons and stuff, so you should be fine. So you roll when they're red, press Y when they're green. Oh, what in the fuck? Oh yeah, that's those are traps. Just wait for them to come to you. I didn't expect the traps. <laughs> I didn't either. Do you understand what it is we do now? Or did I rush you through the rules, pushing you into the play before you were prepared? Noble trader Wealth again. separates the highest from the lowest. And that no is fucking point now if my gold's just gonna months. fall out of my pocket. take the noble man this time or not? I mean the weapon really doesn't do much unless you take damage and you don't want to take damage so yeah the token might be better alright five gold gate cards fifteen ten forty Three. Fifteen. I like that they went with, like, instead of just five, ten, fifteen, twenty, three! Yeah, three. <laughs> Not five, but three. It's like a bigger insult to injury. <laughs> Alright, we're at a shop. Well, time to buy it a weapon and be on with our day. For real. <laughs> Huge hammer. <coughs> Excuse me. 
As you string together consecutive attacks, you do greatly increase damage. Press left bumper to unleash a force explosion. That sounds pretty cool. Consuming shame. All weapon attacks are enhanced with a powerful poison that taints the victim's mind and body. Mmm, interesting. This helm imbues the wearer with greater mo <coughs> movement speed. <coughs> I don't think that will help you. And during combat, every hit you sustain increases your speed and weapon strength. Hmm. Everything here, too bad I don't have the money for it. They all build on each other and I could... I know. Do I have anything I can sell? <laughs> I have an axe your and a axe. shield. <laughs> that would give you five. Uh, yeah, that's not enough. <laughs> Actually, you would only get three. <coughs> Excuse me. Fuck. I almost want to say the armor would be better. Mm. Because if you get hit, at least you get a way to r run away and you get stronger. Yeah. I also don't have any armor, I think, on me right now. That's also true. So that might make a big fucking difference. <laughs> I mean, it it probably only gives like a 5% buff to your defense. Yeah. But it will help you in the long run. So we're going with armor? Yeah, armor. The axe is decent, I mean. The hammer? Armor and you have to hit things with a heavy hammer of a barbarian, multiple times to even, like, make it work. Examination. I just got insulted. <laughs> what the fuck? <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, we'll do the armor. Interesting choice. I don't think you need to buy food or anything. Especially since you still have the token for the <laughs> priest guy. <laughs> and he's yeah. just gonna rob you blind <laughs> of your food. Uh, I, can just, I can buy the angel's wing if I just want to move really fast. <laughs> I don't think you would have... You would lose control of your character <laughs> at that point. You're gonna get more speed while you get hit, and you're gonna be fast already. I can't heal. Uh. You heal when you eat. Oh, so you heal, good. like, five while you eat. So every time you move. Actually, it's maybe one, but still. <coughs> A slight rustling behind you. Draw a monster card. It is one that for every movement you gain. Every time you eat, basically, you gain one health. I'm gonna test something in a minute. In about 24 minutes, I want you to tell me if ads roll again. Alright. Again. The last one. No! Oh my god. My controller stopped one short, but it was success. <laughs> well, it's a good thing because I'm, I'm sure I would call a star failure. <laughs> Medium armor, a healing cap. <laughs> healing cap, because you already have armor. In my day, we simply avoided being wounded. Look, healing bitch. will suffice, however. I can't dodge it every time. 
Give me all that food for when I run into that bitch. Well, that's that's only gonna cost Roaming you even ever more. Forward, hunting for the truth. Shh. Forest escape. You're gonna give him more food, and you're gonna be left with even less. Shut up. Ah, <coughs> <coughs> oh, fruit. Your path forward takes you into the forest. Take the forest path. You embark on the next leg of your adventure. Think about the way we play Which this game. Which is still having problems. You continue yeah. to die, yet we reset the board each time. One has to wonder how it is possible to truly lose. Oh, here comes our gold. Woo! Bring the merchant back. Son of a fuck. Combat though. The face of pressing the button at the right time, but still. Okay, run, run, run. You see the like green smoke on the ground? Yeah. That's like a. Uh, that's from the plagues. They release that toxic cloud around. So you want to move away from that cloud as soon as you see it. And you can, you'll understand that you are poisoned when you see like a little sparkle on your person. Oh, okay. Oh my god! Stronger though with that armor. <coughs> oh my god, my health. Ugh. What's the healing cap do? Uh, fuck. It says any healing I get is doubled. Okay. So as soon as you hit another. Let me see. Huh? Yeah, I got 12 healing on that one. Man, this was not a great room. No, it's not. At least it's only four dust. Watch out for bear traps. Take any damage there. Two or one, maybe one. Either one. Would have been Oh. <laughs> well. 
We've got huge hammer, scorching zeal again, or medium armor. Whichever one you want, really. Except the armor. Well, we know what this one does. This one is that consecutive one again, I think. I don't know if that will be useful. Sometimes form because you constantly are bouncing back between enemies. In this case, it's yeah, but they're consecutive. Like it goes up each guess. time you do a hit and you don't get hit. Oh, then yeah, then do that. Food. Food. Plus, if you don't like the hammer, you know, never pick up the hammer again. Yep. Alright, I think this is the boss room. You said that last time! All the world oh, well. is a game board. <coughs> well, it was the boss room. Us women merely players. Shut up. That's, what, that's the joke I was going to make last time. I maintain the rules. You have choices, and I have predestination. Your choices, though, are merely a rediscovery of that which you already know. Ember Town Hero. A quest that may lead you down many paths towards jealously guarded secrets. Interesting. You come across an injured adventurer whose battered and bloodied armor tells you he's seen combat. Ask him of his trouble? Or ignore him. <laughs> this is your story. I guess ask him. I've been chasing a pack of thieves that, att that attacked my home village in Embertown. I killed some of them in an ambush, but I fear I lack the strength to chase the rest down. If you have any honor, you will find those jackals and make them pay. Embertown hero. Oh. So that's going to pop up somewhere on the map. I placed it on my way to leave. <laughs> well, looks like you're gonna be a hero. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, while well, this shop loads, I'm gonna take a quick few second break and blow my nose. Because I need to really badly. I think that's due to the Twitch thing. Yeah, that I figured. Everyone went away. I figured. That's pretty fair. Oh man, my nose. Because I think people were interested in the game. Everybody's interested in the game when it's my fucking misery. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> <coughs> I saw that Brawlhalla got some new characters. Oh, don't play Brawlhalla right now. I saw the Avatar stuff. Well, I logged it, on because I had an Amazon. They link. released a, a new character that is super broken. Is it the new guy I just got? Because remember, I've got the pass. Yeah, it's the boots. Okay. Fortitude's breath. Every third encounter does not consume food. Press B to shield bash a target stunning it. Uh, this helm imbues the wearer with the movement speed. Every third combat, the player receives plus 20 health. Increases the wearer's movement speed. G? Zus, I can be a fast boy. Okay. Um. You can have two rings, one helmet. You could get a better shield. Yeah, because I just have a very basic shield right now. Mm hmm I like also that I'm not consuming all of my food. Mm-hmm. And I don't really need to be fast anymore. I've got that going for me already. Yeah. The Ring of Survival is only $10? What the fuck? Well, let's get the ring of survival and the shield. Are you sure that's the right approach? Don't question me, Jack of Blades. What will you do with that? 
What the fuck do you mean? What am I gonna do with that? <laughs> This level is over here too. Hopefully. And then just like Psychonauts, I'll promise to play two and it'll be a year. <laughs> I haven't touched it. Oh. As long as you can get past this the next king level, is one of the you actually will unlock great another Yet treasure. Here he lies, dead and unforgiven. His time is now long. I don't think there's anything here that we want. You see an ancient ornate coffin in the main burial chamber. It may hold spectacular wealth, but it will surely be guarded. Draw two monster cards. I don't even get an option to just keep walking. I have to. Uh, Y'all, some bitches! Six bandits to keep you on your toes. <laughs> you can sneak away. <laughs> I think you're gonna have to sneak away here. I think the top card is huge success. Because I kept my eye on it and it, it went to the top. Yes, the top one is. So just go with this one? The first one, yeah. Oh! <sighs> on your way out of the tomb, you stop to silently empty the pockets of the recently deceased adventurer. Well. <laughs> I was not about to fight 12 fucking dust. <laughs> not when I gotta be the hero of Embertown. Let's find out what type of character you really are. <coughs> this oh will unlock God. more cards if you can defeat this encounter. You've caught up with the Embertown village raiders who call out, stay your hand adventure and we will share the spoils with you. Refuse. You have to kill them. You tell them to ask for... Oh, I fucked up! <laughs> you tell them to ask their gods for more mercy than you are about to show them. Two dust. What's the month? Oh, two dust. Wow! These poor, poor bandits. Oh, the shield looks good. So two hits killed that guy. Yeah. And it was consecutive. I'd hit him after. Three game cards. Three food. <coughs> I'm sure you're grateful for that. Five health. We get the token. Afterwards, you return to tell the hero of Ember Town of your success. He gestures for you to come closer. In silence, he hands you a jeweled ring, then dies. You put the ring away to identify later and bury the fallen champion. The card. The token, token is ours. It's now yours. <laughs> it is yours. You can take it. Doesn't really matter who, what what that guy's story. All he wanted is. Were you hoping this was the end? No. Another flaw awaits. I was hoping this was the end, you dick. <laughs> Guessing. Your because currency is spent. Floors. Your memories tattered and torn. There are five ambushes. We've gone through three of them. Play with. Ah. Okay. Oh my fuck. I'm sick of them. I'm so sick of them. I don't. You take that out of the the deck. I think that's in it. Oh, ah! <sighs> oh my god. Y'all are coming to me. Fuck this shit. <laughs> I ain't moving. <laughs> I'm on this side. You fucking heathens. Okay, 
Amber is good. <laughs> you recover some food from the rat carcasses. Does that mean we're eating rat meat? Funny. The White Council. It's a storyline for you if you win. <coughs> so this will unlock the White Council times two. As I don't know what this does. <laughs> As dusk settles, you arrive at a small village. I love how you're just <laughs> you sound like an edited narrator I put into the game. As dusk settles, you arrive at a small village known as Lesser Dimsgate. The locals are gathered at a shabby-looking inn. Something must be done, shouts a voice, raised in anger. They took all our gold and food, one peasant wails. Will nobody stand up to them? Offer to help or ignore. I'm gonna sound this is going to make you laugh. Boy. I become the Navi of this adventure. Please, God. <laughs> Do we want to <laughs> offer to help or ignore him? Do you want the token or not? Uh, I want the fucking token. Then you have to offer help. They went that way not an hour ago. <laughs> you easily catch up with the, with the band of ruffians. They seem overly confident and are in no rush. As you approach, the one who seems to be their leader notices you. Kill him, he commands, gesturing towards you. He looks like a troublemaker. As opposed to what? What are y'all if I'm a troublemaker? <laughs> the dealer draws two monster cards. Five dust. I can handle bird dust. Oh, well, immediately got hit. <laughs> but it only makes you stronger. Well, they don't know. I don't know, if I knew it, I was... Every time I hit someone, they were going to get stronger and they're trying to kill me. I'd probably just run away. <laughs> <laughs> you gather the stolen supplies and return them to the villagers, saying those bandits will trouble you no longer. Oh, they weren't bandits, a child explains. They worked for the White Council. It was our oh. turn to give tribute. The card's token is now yours. Okay. So what you're telling me is I should have ignored that shit. <laughs> we've uh, we've kind of just helped uh, a cult. Uh, Alpha priest. I have like no gold on me. Well, then you really don't need to visit the priest. Look, it's a nice break from what's going to be a, probably another death, right? I can get rid of the loose pockets. It's only eight gold. Oh, the curse? Yeah. Then yeah, do that. To get rid of the one for this level, it's 150. <laughs> I can't buy any blessings. All right. It's cool to see. Oh my god, I wish I could have had that. The holy touch. Ugh. Oh. I can't afford any of them, but that would have been cool to have. And I'm not gonna sell any. Hey, Mr. Lionel! Ah! I loved his card in the beginning. <laughs> well, 
Whilst enjoying your evening meal at the local tavern, a strange old man takes the seat next to yours. He taps your shoulder quite painfully with his wooden staff to get your attention, and you notice that he appears to be a goblin, poorly disguised as a human. His wizened face grins at you with a hint of madness. My name is Mr. Lionel. If you give me what I need, <coughs> I will conjure up your heart's desire with this wizarding wand of my own creation. He cackles uncontrollably for a few minutes, then sits patiently waiting for your answer. Well, I don't have gold. I can give him the bread on my plate. I can ask him what I mean, he needs. like ten food, but I don't. Th you have so much food. What if that's not what he wants, though? Then I just lose food. He'll give you. He only just wants things. He considers the bread seriously before placing it carefully in his coat pocket, seemingly satisfied. Yeah, that was uh, one food. He then sits considering you for a while before slapping the table with his hand. Aha! I know what you need. Here, Mr. Lionel pulls out a large empty cloth sack and holds it open for you. Reach in and you'll receive your heart's desire. Draw one oh. equipment card. Well, poison. It's the tool of the traitor. Consum seven consuming shame. All weapon attacks are enhanced with a powerful poison that taints the victim's mind and body. I, I would say that's pretty good. Then, before you can stop him, with inhuman speed, he snatches a pickled onion off your plate and sprints out the tavern door. I like this. I like one. him. I like him. He's a good, <laughs> he's a good character. <laughs> I like his little story. Another cave mouth. My god, this is a long adventure. Yeah, this is about to go up as one video. On this floor, the <laughs> Golly. Waits for you. Oh. He is prepared. This is a two hour Are adventure. You? <laughs> We're on the boss floor now. <coughs> what did he say? <coughs> Hold on. Oh, was there. Well, now you can't tell me. Was there ads earlier? No. How do I do them myself? If I run an ad break, does that mean it stops auto doing it? You're the one viewer. <laughs> I still don't know how fucking ads work. I was trying to set them on a timer to where I could be like, oh, this is when they'll go off, so then I can go take a break. Okay. A winding trail. Suddenly a tree falls across your path, blocking the way. The dealer draws one monster card. No king falls without a challenge. God damn it. I have four gold, so are they gonna I think say... it? You could give him your... we could try. That's not enough. He's holding out on us! <laughs> oh god. Oh yeah, okay, artifact. I'm not well, fuck, I wonder if I should use it now. You have seven charges of it. Oh, boy. Okay. doing so shit here I would just roll and hit
go heal it with the ring anyway. Armory! <laughs> Frost Fang! <laughs> Well, <coughs> I think that just see what the frost thing does, but don't take it. Equipment with well, this trait is imbued with glacial power. Lizard men are especially susceptible to ice damage. Oh, well, interesting. Each hit slows the target with cold. Press left bumper mm. to shoot a cone of ice. I mean, you could take the frost thing, but just not use it. It doesn't lose, you don't lose your hammer. Oh, 20 gold. How about that? Could have used that a second ago, motherfucker. Helpful priest! Oh my god, they're all in here. <laughs> okay, you would have 15 gold. I would give. Well, he, he doesn't have a token. Nope. He'll bless me, but there's no token. Uh, we don't need a blessing. <laughs> we don't need your blessing. <laughs> oh, man. I really am naughty in the storyline. <laughs> I don't know which way to go. Like, I don't want to risk keep losing health and then go in to fight this dude. I think he's in the corner on the bottom. Like, all the way to the bottom right? Mm-hmm. Hey! <laughs> it's Mr. Lionel. Uh, oh, hey! <coughs> <Good> job, man. <coughs> Win this and claim my token. Oh, this has a token. One night, as you lie in the forest clearing, you are disturbed by the sight of a shadowy figure watching from the darkness. Well met, the goblin exclaims, stepping into the light and sitting by the fire. Just the armed warrior I've been seeking. Elaborate. The goblin makes himself comfortable. My name is Mr. Lionel. Haha, <laughs> it is. <laughs> And I have a tale of woe to share with you, and perhaps an opportunity for you to make a tidy profit from my misfortune. He goes on to tell the story of his troubles with the king of the goblins while lamenting his subsequent banishment from the goblin community. The king could have shown leniency, he concludes, given that his daughter and I were both drunk from the excellent Dollison Brandy served at his coronation. Instead, he opted to make his first official act my banishment. The fool will regret it, though. For now, it is time for revenge, he says eagerly, taking out a strange amulet. For hundreds of years, the Goblin Kings have gathered treasure and hoarded it in a series of enchanted it and ever-changing... It has been called the game of eternity that we play. <laughs> I didn't think that meant you'd take forever to make a decision. I haven't been given a decision yet, you asshole. Enchanted and ever-changing treasure vaults. Only the Goblin King himself knows where his treasure vaults are hidden. But now I have a way to find them. I just need to lock... I need a lock of elven hair to complete this magical device. Uh, you have to accept it to get the token, probably. I mean, you're helping your friend here. Who sounds like all he did was have sex. <laughs> He's getting punished for something people do daily. <coughs> Excellent. He's getting punished because it's basically the king's daughter. She sounds like she consented. Anyways. Excellent. Just get, just get there by any means possible. Don't worry. I'll find you again once your quest is complete. It's a good thing I have wings, or I would have face palmed. <laughs> With that, he returns to the shadows and sits down behind a bush, watching you. <laughs> so that means all the story cards are going to be in this area. Oh, God. Hi. Ah! Ah! 
You're going straight then, I guess. Just kidding! Found the end of it! <laughs> so foolish well. as to deliver themselves to the king. The king is fierce in battle, but loyal to his troops. He can choose to heal them during battle. <laughs> so you have to kill his troops. He has made himself rich and powerful through the genius application of cruelty and terror. Okay. A challenge for you, and a token if you succeed. Remember, red roll. Red roll, that's B. No, that's A, sorry. Okay. You probably could have actually waited and go to the other cards, but this. I think you really just want to get your revenge on him. Remember your artifact. Right, ticket. Of my Calm down. As for me, I think you have but proven that I must defeat you entirely. Playing by yourself, a set of new trinkets. And more. <laughs> to fighting that king cleared my throat. <laughs> Who looted Ember Town? You get Ring of Justice for helping the people of Lesser Dimsgate. You receive the White Council too. <laughs> oh boy, we helped the cult for joining. The oh Lions no, Club. they're locked in. They're locked in our deck now. Yeah, for joining Mr. Lionel's quest, this card gave the maiden. I thought I had her. Oh, the the maiden. Well, this is like an upgraded version. As a reward for defe defeating the bandit king, you receive these cards: feathered ice, life's limb, jack of scales, hero's remains, stranger in the shadows, and the old graveyard. Come, come once more to the game. <sighs> You did it! That was so long. <laughs> I...